Veterans from across the country are in the capital city today for the Professional Armed Forces World Championship Rodeo. And KCNT News reporter James Ryan happens to be live in central Topeka. We would expect nothing less. He's going to let us know what people can expect. Yes, David, tonight's competition is going to honor first responders and service men and women, uh, ser uh, emergency service workers. So you're going to see the military community uh, supporting and lifting up another community that serves. Now, the Professional Armed Forces World Championship Rodeo starts tonight, and it's a three-day event in Landon Arena. It will include all your favorite events like bull riding, bronc riding, roping, and barrel racing. Bull organizers say it's the connection to our military that makes the event so special. The competition is pretty good. These, these guys compete together, and everybody wants to win. But in the end, we share two loves. We share the love of our country, and we share the love of rodeo. And so there's a special bond between veterans, no matter what f part of the forces you serve us. Because when we deploy, when we go do what our nation's calling, um, obviously we do that collectively. Along with the competition, there will also be a Kids Cowboy College at 2 Saturday. Around 50 kids will join the contestants in the arena, and they'll teach them the tricks of the trade before that final night of competition. But it all starts tonight, and again, each of these competitors is either active due to military, retirees, veterans, DOD civilians, or their family. And so definitely come out, come see a great show, but also support a community that is supporting you. Live in Central Topeka, covering local news that matters. James Ryan, KSNT News. It looks ready to go, like they could start right now. James, thank you for that. The Professional Armed Forces World Championship Rodeo runs tonight through Saturday. The rodeo begins at 6 o'clock each night, and those doors open at 5. So enjoy. <laughs>